<laughs> Yo guys, what is up? It's Taylor from Tuesday Night back with another vlog. I have to be a little bit quiet so there's no background music on this thing once again. Um, and some of you guys don't actually like that, so this is going to be a raw vlog. Um, it's kind of, I'm going to bed soon, it's like 10, 30, 11 -ish. I'm just checking my financial standings, is what I call it or whatever. I'm looking at prices for some old toys or whatever that I have that may be worth money or are worth money right now. I'm also playing my Game Boy. Who remembers these things? Pokemon Fire Red. That was my first actual game and first own handheld device. The first console I think I've ever had was Nintendo 64. Um, if you want me to play that in the game or the videos, I could surely do that. I'm sorry if my voice sounds raspy. I'm just really tired at the moment. Um, I have this thing here. This I looked up. It's only worth 30 bucks right now. But projected 5% is going up every single year, which is pretty awesome. Um, these are just a bunch of old Pokemon stickers. There's no date, no information of any kind. So originally I thought these were manufactured by somebody that's from the third party. But these were actually, these came with the launch of Pokemon Snap, which is kind of cool. Shout out to you if you know that old classic game. These are all screen caps from the movies, and there is one really rare one right here. This is the rarest one. This was an exclusive. It has a mark on it. I'm so mad. But this is actually worth $50 alone, which is insane. Let me put that there. Uh, all the Pikachus are worth 5 bucks each, except for that one, obviously. Uh, this one's 3 bucks. Jigglypuff's worth 20 bucks. Darlith, 4 bucks. Mankey, 4 bucks, probably. Slowpoke, I couldn't find a price for that one. Uh, another 20 bucks, I believe. Arbok was a hard to rare find one, so that was 15. Almanite was another exclusive one, so that was another 15. I'm gonna save that for last. Pikachu, 5 bucks. Aerodactyl was a 15 to 20. 5 bucks. Paras was a, was a $3 one, because it was so common. Mr. Mime, actually. These are the two most popular ones here. Um, and the Pikachu one with the current, obviously. Let's start with Mr. Mime. This was a one pack exclusive, so there's one in every hundred of them, every hundred games. And I have one, luckily. I have a bunch of these. So each of these would be in one game. Uh, I gave a lot of them away, but I did. I only gave the doubles away. So I kept all the singles. So this is actually a $65 one. And this one was only one in a thousand games. So this is the rarest one, obviously. And this one is worth, I believe, last time I checked, was 135 And that's going up 5% every day. So Or not every day, what am I saying? 5% every year. So those should be going pretty good, but they went five percent. They went. They were ta ten percent down last year, which sucked. Um, but yeah, this also has a series with it, as you can tell. I have that hanging up. I gotta play this a lot more. Um, one more thing. These are actually a lot of Digimon characters. This has a keychain. Uh, I was looking these up. I only got through one tin so far. I'm gonna do the other tin later on, but I only got through one tin. Um, I have to go back and check with the list. So I just checked up my paper, and this whole tin is actually worth $450, going up by 2% every year, so not that much of a jump. And now to check this here. This is going to take a while, there's a lot more. So guys, it's like 11.30 now, I just finished checking everything up here. This is actually, this whole thing here is worth, hang on, i got to check my paper. So since I have the gold rare collection pack in here, this is actually worth $356. I'm running out of memory, guys. Just hang on a sec. Okay, guys. There we go. How much this is? $340? I think so. But that's worth $340. I have my gold collection in there. Um, it's ones with chromish colors or gold colors, as some of you like to call it. Uh, I have a lot more toys or whatever you want to call them. Knickknacks, whatever you want to call them. Downstairs in my basement. Yeah. There might be one or two. I think this one has all my keychains with it. These are each worth five bucks a pop. And yeah, don't ever discard your old toys that are below 1980. But yeah, guys, um, I just checked some of them. Obviously, I'm not going to check all of them. If you want me to do a live checking or whatever, I'm happy to do that. Uh, that's up to you, though. I love these little things. I got them uh, a long time ago, actually, like three or four years ago. Uh, I say a long time ago, because that's a long time for me. I'm only 15, obviously. I'm in that cringy stage or whatever you like to call it. I just stopped playing my Game Boy for now. I was playing and checking. I just wanted to update you guys on my, um, my 
thing beside my desk here. Sorry if I'm really quiet or my voice is like raspy. It's because I'm really tired. But I just put all the cameras that I found that are old or whatever. Or the cameras that I have are the knees or the newest ones. They're on date, obviously. Um, this is actually an old Polaroid. I got this from the thrift shop for three bucks. It's worth $28 on eBay. It works and everything. That's a classic. Sun 600. Look it up if you guys don't believe me. Uh, you do you, whatever. And this is this is actually my family's video camera. I'm trying to get this thing to work so I can look at all the tapes. All the tapes are in a bag down there. It's hard to see. Right there, that bag's full of tapes. Um, and we come down here. Let me turn. Let me turn these lights on for you guys. That's not working. There we go. Now we come down here. We have all my filming gear and everything. Uh, my uh, USBs. Uh, a lightning port to USB. Uh, iPod Nano I just found randomly. Uh, I actually invested in two clip-on mics. I will be using those for further videos once I figure out how to get them to work. Um, lenses for my phone. Tripod. I'm using a tripod right now. Selfie stick or whatever. VR system. That's for something in the future. But yeah, I'll, if you guys want to see down here, these are all my DS games. 3DS, I should say. I'm trying to get all the Pokemon games, or the DS and 3DS. So far, I have all the 3DS games. I'm just waiting on Ultra Ultra Moon to come out and Ultra Sun. Um, I'm only getting one of the versions because I only collect one of the versions. Uh, I also have um, Pokemon Rumble Blast. It's hard to see. Um, but I actually made that. That's kind of cool. I made that. I'll talk to you about that in a further video. But I'm really tired, and this vlog's not going to be that long. Just showing off my collection or whatever you guys like to call it. But I'm really tired, guys. I have this Toronto Maple Leaf hoodie. You want me to put it on? I'll put it on for you guys. You want to see my Pikachu slippers? My older brother actually got me these for Christmas. I'm a big Pokemon fan, if you guys can't tell. I know a great tenor that likes Pokemon, whatever. Um, but yeah, my dad actually gave me this. I'm a huge fan of Toronto Maple Leafs. If you can't tell, Quinn, you want to take that camera for a sec? And just show it off. It's a little long, as you can tell. But yeah, it's CCM. It says it somewhere. Right there. Brand name. See that? Thanks, Quinn. He's still awake because I, I was keeping him awake. Sorry about that, Quinn. Okay. Um, I had something else to say, but I can't remember right now. Whatever. Um, uh, I'm actually going on a youth retreat with Gabe. So that should be an awesome vlog. We're going three days through this camp, which is pretty cool. Um, once again, sorry if I'm a little quieter. I don't know if anybody's asleep right now. I still hear the water running. So some of you did in the shower or washing up or whatever. Um, I have my 2DS. You guys want to see my, my 2DS? I also have a DS. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, what's this? You get bonus points if you know what that's called. Why is there tissues? I can't find my DS. Well, I can't find my DS for some reason. Which is really weird. Let me give it one more check. No, no DS, but I did find this. Wow, what a nerd am I? People at school actually call me nerds. <laughs> Pokemon nerd or whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Pokemon is actually kind of fun if you get into it. I played a lot as a kid, so that's why. It was my first ever game. Let me get the one here for you guys. There we go. I'm sorry. Uh, Pokemon Fire Red. I'm sorry if I'm really shaky. I'm just, I just have shaky hands or whatever. I'm actually really tired, so I'm gonna go to bed right now. At least try to go to bed. And then, I'll see you guys in the morning, I guess. I don't know what else is there. It's a school day. And you guys wanna see an update of my fish? You can't even see them. Where is my light thing now? I'm losing everything today. Oh, there it is. Yeah, they're still all alive. Even this one. Chilling. Chilling. They're all chilling. I'm gonna go to bed now. Hit the sack, Quinn. Put some shirts on. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm not gonna end the vlog. It's gonna be a little longer. Hope you guys enjoy that. Um, bye. So guys, I'm leaving for school now. As you can tell, I got my attire or whatever. This is what I usually wear. It's pants, shoes, sometimes a sweater, not really. Same hat and glasses, obviously, so I can see. It's really windy today. It's supposed to get up to 40 to 50 clicks even.
that table still out there. Oh shoot, we gotta flip that upside down. Oh, that's gonna go flying everywhere. Um, the fish are doing great. I gotta leave for school now, so I'll either see you at school or just this is gonna be the end of the video. Told you guys it was gonna be windy as heck today. <laughs>